and this is Trooper. And today we're working on an exercise to soften the horse using four cones. So what we're gonna do, this is an outside exercise. So starting at a walk, mainly point the toe at the inside, put the nose in, and release. And when you go to the next cone, Tip the nose and release. Now, outside leg, outside leg. And once he gives his nose, and I can see the corner of his nose and the corner of his eye, then we'll move on to the next cone. Now this is very tight. There we go. So, as soon as he releases his nose, there we go. So I'm not having to pull on his nose, pull and release, pull and release. But as soon as he drops down, my hand is going into the release mode. So there, pull and release, pull and release, touch and release, touch and release. And I'm going to keep going around this corner until I feel him softening up. And there we go. See how it's nice and easy and I'm not really pulling on that inside? Remember, this is outside leg exercise. So tip the nose. Release the nose, outside leg, outside leg. Good, see how he's really curving around just off the leg? That's good. Ooh. So, the object of the game is it's all mostly leg, a little bit of inside ring. So now that we've done one side, let's do another. So, usually I like to start on the bad side. If the bad side, that means the side that's not um, flexible, we'll do that. So for him, we're going to work on this right circle. So pull and release. There we go. He's giving me his head. I like that. So let's go to the second one. Tip the nose. Point the inside toe. Outside. Outside. Good. Outside. I have very little pressure on his nose. Tip the nose. Press with my leg. Press with my leg. Press with my leg. I'm really exaggerating it, but he's listening really well. Tip the nose. Press with the leg. Press with the leg. Press with the leg. Pull and press. Pull and press. Pull and press. Pull and press. Good. Last one. Sit up. Tip the nose. Press with the leg. Press with the leg. Press with the leg. Tip the nose. That's not very soft. I'm going to keep walking. So, there we go. Tip the nose. Tip the nose. Tip the nose. There. It's starting to give a little bit better. So, we're going to do this eventually at a trot. This is a very tight pattern. Um, they're only about 20 feet across, and we're going to ask for a little bit more of a nice little trot, but it's going to be a tight trot. A tight trot with a lot of turn. So, up to the next one, up to the next one. Outside leg, outside leg, outside leg, outside leg. Obviously, at a trot, you don't get as good of a circle, but nose is tipped in, outside leg. The big thing is, listening to the outside leg and turning off the leg and not turning off the ring. So, tip his nose, tip his nose, but he's listening to that leg. What we do on one side, we do on the other. So, I'm going to tip him around. And now, we're going to go to the inside, which is my right. So, now we can really see this is the side he doesn't like. See how big that circle was? Now we'll just work on getting a little tighter. Okay. Getting him a little bit better turn. Oh, that really went too far outside. So anytime he really goes away from it, I'll come back in, tip him up a little bit more. <laughs> he was like, okay, I'll tip up. I'll listen. Remember, the tighter the circle, the more their muscles have to work. And the more their muscles have to work, the harder it is for them. So having a little tight pattern.
pattern like this really makes them work. And we saw how far out that was. There we go. There we go. I was pretty happy with that. That was much better and much tighter. So, the smaller the circle, the more you make the horse work, and the more you can isolate working off your legs as opposed to just working off a direct rein. And eventually, you can add an indirect rein completely, and that will give you a much better neck rein around the cones. So thank you so much for joining us on today's lesson, and if you enjoyed the lesson, give us a like, and if you haven't already, please subscribe. And remember to see more, check out our playlists.